Raccoons, with their distinct black masks and mischievous demeanor, have always been a source of fascination for humans. These nocturnal creatures are known for their adaptability and intelligence, but one peculiar behavior often leaves observers intrigued, the ability to walk on their front legs. While raccoons are generally quadrupeds, moving on all fours, instances of them walking exclusively on their front legs have been documented. In this video, we will delve into the reasons behind this behavior, exploring the biological, ecological, and evolutionary aspects that might shed light on the mystery of raccoons walking on their front legs. Biomechanics of Raccoon Locomotion Raccoons are well adapted for life in both terrestrial and arboreal environments. Their hind limbs are robust, providing them with the strength and agility required for climbing trees and navigating various terrains. However, the structure of their forelimbs is equally remarkable. Raccoons possess flexible wrist joints, allowing them to rotate their paws much like human hands. This dexterity is especially useful for manipulating objects, a skill that has earned them a reputation for being adept scavengers. When raccoons walk on their front legs, they exhibit a peculiar bipedal gait, resembling a shuffling motion. Observers often note the agility with which raccoons use their front paws, almost resembling a primate-like movement. This behavior is not a common occurrence, and understanding the triggers behind it requires a closer look at the ecological context. Ecological Factors Raccoons are opportunistic omnivores, known for their scavenging habits. In urban areas, where human activities generate an abundance of food sources, raccoons may adopt different behaviors to exploit these resources. Walking on their front legs could be a strategy employed in specific situations, such as when foraging in garbage bins or navigating urban landscapes. The ability to walk on two legs allows raccoons to reach higher surfaces and access potential food items that might be out of reach when moving on all fours. Additionally, raccoons may resort to walking on their front legs as a defensive mechanism. When threatened or cornered, adopting a bipedal stance may make them appear larger and more intimidating to potential predators. This behavior could serve as a deterrent, deterring would-be attackers and providing the raccoon with an opportunity to escape. Social Behavior and Communication Raccoons are known for their complex social structure and communication skills. Walking on their front legs could also be a form of communication within the raccoon community. It may serve as a signal to other raccoons, conveying information about food availability, danger, or territory boundaries. The bipedal gait may carry social significance, helping raccoons establish hierarchy or navigate social interactions in ways that are not yet fully understood by researchers. Evolutionary Perspectives Understanding the reasons behind raccoons walking on their front legs requires considering their evolutionary history. Raccoons belong to the Procyonidae family, which includes other species like coatis and kinkajous. These species share common ancestors and have evolved to adapt to diverse environments. The ability to walk on two legs might have ancient roots in the evolutionary history of raccoons. Early ancestors may have developed this trait as a way to navigate different terrains or exploit new food sources. Over time, as raccoons diversified and adapted to various environments, the bipedal behavior could have persisted as a flexible and advantageous trait in certain circumstances. Conclusion While the mystery of why raccoons walk on their front legs is not fully unraveled, it is clear that this behavior is a product of a combination of biomechanical, ecological, social, and evolutionary factors. Raccoons, as highly adaptable and intelligent creatures, showcase a range of behaviors that allow them to thrive in diverse environments. Observing and studying these behaviors not only adds to our understanding of raccoons, but also highlights the fascinating ways in which animals can adapt to the challenges presented by their surroundings. As research in animal behavior continues, we can expect to uncover more about the nuances of raccoon locomotion and the intricate ways in which these charismatic creatures interact with their environment. Are you thinking about getting a raccoon? Let us know what you decide in the comments below. And if you know someone who's thinking about getting a raccoon, please share this with them. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Otherwise, have a great day. Thanks for watching.